Okay, right here was the site of the priest's house, the original priest's house called the Hermitage. And the residential priest lived here from 1890, before our building was even constructed, all the way up to 1969 when the last residential priest left. The Hermitage was um, a great cottage right by all the orchards and everything else. And the summit has been blessed over our time with some really dedicated priests who have contributed a lot to shaping our school. And our second priest, Father Francis Xavier Lassance, who was the summit's priest from 1891 um, up through the 1920s. He was a very dear friend of Sister Julia McGroarty, who was our foundress. And he was also extremely well known as a religious writer in the global Catholic community. He authored over 39 books that were translated into many languages, published millions of copies for which he would take no compensation. You can still actually order his Catholic Girl's Guide, his Young Man's Guide, and a number of his other uh, inspirational writings from Amazon. What he was also known for, though, is donating the Raffle Crucifix that's above the main altar. Following his retirement from the summit in 1927, he received a special blessing from Pope Pius XI for his devotional writings.